Joining me from Anish Vikramaditya, the flagship of Indian Navy, is the Chief of the Naval Staff, Admiral Suri Lamba. He has come here from New Delhi to witness and review the annual theatre level exercise of the Indian Navy, which is a very complex exercise, which involves both the fleets and we will have the Admiral uh, giving us the overall aim of this exercise. Every year in the month of January, February and March, we hold an annual exercise called the Tropics, where both the fleets, the Western Fleet and the Eastern Fleet, get together to hone their combat skills. It is divided into a number of phases. It starts off with the independent exercise by the two fleets. This year, the Western Fleet, Eastern Fleet has come from Vishakhapatnam to the Western Seaboard. The two fleets independently exercise. Then they carry out joint exercises where they do joint drills. And then there is a phase of tactical firings. Yesterday I witnessed the engagement of uh, missiles with surface-to-air missiles. And today we are going to do another surface-to-air surface missile firing. They carry out a number of drills including exercising with submarines and aircrafts. The main aim being to have owning the combat skill and combat readiness of the entire fleet. So we also know that the tropics is being done year on year, but uh, we know that uh, the complexities are being in the, uh, increased. Now we also have the space element coming in. We have a lot of uh, white shipping over here. So how are we uh, maintaining our MDA and other things? See, uh, every year as the tropics, there are certain focus areas which are identified and combat areas which need to be proved and the exercises are drawn around these focus areas to raise the issue of the space element and the maritime domain awareness. On all board, on all ships, we have network centric operations where data from all the sensors including the space elements are fused and a combined maritime domain awareness picture generated which is a common picture shared in all the operation rooms of all the ships. And so we also know that today we are going to get the AVACs and we are going to get a, a very large kind of an exercise is going to be witnessed by you sir and reviewed by you which involves the AEW aircraft coming in from uh, hinterland. We are going to have Sukhois, we are going to have uh, the Jaguars and uh, the interceptions will be carried out by our own mix. Yes, yeah, so this is uh, a free throw combat exercise where all the elements both underwater, air and surface elements will be exercised together. So you have the flagship out here where incoming strikes will be engaged by the big 29K carried out by the aircraft and launched from here. Similarly electronic missiles and other engagements will be fired so that each unit can exercise its entire combat capability so that the crew are at optimum level. Thank you very much, Arthur. Thank you very much.